Warning, this video is not for kids. It is for teens and adults and other mature audiences. If you are a child, please get parental discretion before watching. Today we have the My First Natford Station. Wow, you Maybe. couldn't even keep asking. <laughs> you couldn't even keep the coal in there. All right. So we have the brand new My First line of Thomas and Friends. If every line, of course, they brought this one back. So they have single engines. They did not release those. Just James. Smart move, honestly. No one wants Nia. True. Or Percy or any of them, honestly. Uh, so this is for one and a half year olds. One and a half, specifically. Not one, not two, one and a half. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we'll start. I'll start off with James. Grant can review the passenger car. Mm. So this James is honestly, when you look at it, it's pretty accurate to James, honestly. So for starters, we have black wheels. This is already better than push long and motorized. Um, it's got more, it honestly looks really good. I don't like how big the loop top coupling is at the front, but this one works. Let's just um, show why it's better. So here is the, what we had back in the day when Mattel tortured people. Now they just torture people with the show, not the merch. Mm, so it has real. blue wheels. The tender is a part of the cab. Is it sad that the ones that don't have drivers have better cabs? That, <laughs> so they combine all this. There's the coal, it's blue. All the details are blue instead of black. Um, the face is hideous. All the faces are the same. Well, the all engines go ones print different ones. This one has couplings. This one, that, honestly, this is just awful. 2016 sucked. All right, so, James, I like it. I think this was pretty good James, honestly, for how cheap the set is. And many of you probably thought this was supposed to be the tender. Well, yeah, because, you know, the last one didn't have one. So, obviously, this one doesn't have one. So, obviously, <laughs> that's a tender. Now. But. Well, it's multifunctional. Now, it's a night car. Yes. And now, it's a day slash raining on the other side car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, they, honestly, I think this was a incredible move. Better than this one, therefore it can't be, there's no other comparison, so therefore this one's better. I, I'm just happy they at least give you the coal car option. No. Because knowing Mattel, they should they probably were totally yeah. planning to do just that. <laughs> and then one guy's like, hey, let's give this one as an option at least. Well, one guy was like, isn't James one that has the, the coal car? Oh my gosh, you're right, we could put passengers in it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I mean, it works, and I'm... It's better because at least you get a separate tender. See, it's better because it's Mattel. And if this was Tomy, well, I'd expect better, but exactly, like I, we is, think it's good because the expectations are so low. They're so low that this is probably the best toy Mattel has made for all engines go. Honestly, the like it's a really this is how low our expectations are. <laughs> we. Saw this tender and we're like, whoa, there's a tender. There's a tender. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's a tender. <laughs> and it's not a tender, guys. It's okay. It's a passenger car. It's what Africa. is this depth? I don't think James has a window to his five. <laughs> That's only for the passenger car part. But I honestly do think this was the best move they could have did instead of giving you a No, the best car. move they could have done is make him have a tender and cars. No, because if they did that, it would have been this. We all know they wouldn't have put actual effort into the tender. They didn't put effort. Yeah, they did. This is a beautiful tender. Besides the window. Part. No, they would made the tender. Then some guy came in with an exacto knife, <laughs> cut it out, and then put other stuff in it. It was like, look, it's multifunctional. Honestly, I don't. I I think it's a better idea, and I agree with you. This is. It's only good because your expectations are so low. <laughs> yes, it's only good because of that. I agree. But I do think it's good because You know what's better? They the Napper. Given... Let's get into no, the Napper. No, they should have given us an Ertl. You know that they would have been <laughs> sued to the ground by Ertl. Ertl's dead. Did they go bankrupt? Probably. Probably, yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, back to the... Let's get into the set. So, honestly... 
for this is a really cheap set, so it's a uh, forty dollar. <laughs> No, it's ten dollars. What? That's bullshit. This is ten dollars. This, this is not ten dollars. This is like fifty bucks. I know, right? You expect it to be fifty. I expected it when I saw it go up on Amazon. And it was ten dollars. You're like, crap, that looks expensive. I was like, I was figuring that you the know, single I, engines are gonna be like fifteen dollars each. You know what costs ten dollars gets you in normal stuff? One push along tender engine. That <laughs> or a circle of track. Yeah, the circle with one engine and a cow is the same. This is an amazing deal right now. I think that my first is only like affordable. Like the clock works. Yes, you have a uh, weird shed at the top here. Chuggington. Yeah, I don't, I don't know why we're, we did that in the wooden railway too. It's kind of weird, but it works because the Mattel main- Mattel has a plan. The gimmick of the set <laughs> is a slide. Yay. Wow, we actually stayed here. That's the first time. <laughs> That's the first time it's done that. That's more fun. Honestly, yeah, I mean, this set has so many fun play features, especially if you, uh, Brett, stop. But I'm like a one and a half year old. <laughs> <laughs> especially if you get James in there and go. Ooh. Uh, uh, and then you send, up, send in the passengers. <laughs> and if you open it up, he comes down still. But uh, this part is for the, the evil ones, like. Hen or yeah, the, we, the engine that we kill. We lock them up. It's just trapped in there for the rut. Yeah, lock up. Oh my gosh, that's even. Wait. No, they did. I thought we could give Mattel credit. They made it interactive with the old toys. Nope, they can't even do that. Uh, in fairness, I when Toys R Us was closing, I think I got that for like a dollar. <laughs> Nobody. I'm pretty sure those toys were ten dollars back in the day. So you could have that little my first James. Or you could have this whole set. Hold up. I think this is honestly... Wait, stop. Okay. We got something really wrong. We were saying how, oh my gosh, this looks like $50. Oh my goodness, it's so much better than the other $10 options. This is half a circle. But you're not thinking about it. Uh, look how much, like it goes up and you have a lot more play features than a circle ever does. You have a True, slide, you have a... Half a circle. It's also for one and a half year olds. The circle True. was for five year olds. <laughs> this, this is more fun. Are there any other sets? No, this is like, it. Why does this exist? This exists because it's supposed to. I think this this is how they're launching the line. They didn't launch the line with Thomas. They launched it with the character they wrote out the show. I like that idea. I Wait know. A second. It's like they knew that everyone me only by. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised. Where's Henry? Honestly, let's launch it. They launched James because Second they. Second is like Boko or something. <laughs> <laughs> or duck, quote unquote. Japanese. Jap whoa, whoa, Japan whoa. leaked a duck, so apparently he's coming to all of these guys. <laughs> apparently. Wait, wait. Yeah, I know. I don't believe. Wait. Oh. That looks like it would fit. Look. You yeah, see because the you got thing? the war pipe funnel, you, you think. Also, we have storage up here for that, too. Um, I recommend this set. I think it's great. I don't recommend it unless you're one and a half. Well, yeah, obviously, that's what this is for. If you're not one and a half, like, it's obviously it, not for It's you. not allowed. You'll no. get arrested soon. Yeah, just this like, isn't back in the day when it was just team. like all y'all who buy stuff on Pokemon Go. <laughs> <laughs> This isn't back in the day. We aren't in the era of two to a hundred two these days. No, this, it's two or two. Obviously, I bought this because I'm totally going to give it to my cousin Leo, which fits the demographic of one and a half. He's like seven. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> He's literally one and a half. You're thinking of Isaiah. Oh, I'm thinking of Isaiah. Yeah, there's Isaiah, a Isaiah, Leo, same difference. My brothers. And Anyways, uh, you want to... Okay. Uh, well, if you guys like this video a little more than the last one, then you should probably subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. I think you should subscribe. And honestly, uh, real talk, I do think this is a great set for a one and a half year old. Agreed. Mm-hmm.